Well, okay, where do you start? Um, Ten years old, started going to the beach really a lot with my folks. Ten to thirteen years old, skimboarding and riding on rafts and stuff. Start surfing at thirteen. At the same time, I think it was seventh grade, I had my first wood shop class. And the wood shop teacher was Bob Olson, who made only surfboards at the time. And, uh, I had taken one of my sister's old boards. She's like four years older than me, so I'm 13. What is it, 68, 67, 68. Uh, her and all her Gidget girlfriends surfed for one summer. All bought boards and had these boards left over. So we cut them down. I cut the back off. Reshape the foam on the inside. Take it in the wood shop as a project, because I know my teacher makes surfboards. It's bobbles. So um, he showed me how to fiberglass it. We did it as a class project, and um, we kind of started hanging from there. He showed me all the things about it. And started doing it for friends, and I got a job with this guy, you know, over that first year of school. Kind of did it in my garage, then Oli gave me a job. So it's really all I've kind of known since about 14 as an actual job. We're um, living up in Mammoth. It's 1979. I figure we gotta get some sort of adult job going besides um, being a ski instructor and shape of surfboards out here. So we decided to move back to the beach and start the surfboard thing. Stussy Surfboards was in the heyday of the whole punk era. Had orange spikes, lime green mohair sweater, listen to the pistols. Do punky script pogo. Put it on some t-shirts and start making some boards in Laguna Beach. And, uh, Sold surfboards for three or four years to certain uh, surf shops around the coast. Wow, look at all the guys up there. Mm -hmm. 